Actually, it has changed our life completely. Not in a manner that I can really explain. I used to live here, you know, I relocate. I used to go to school, actually, I am home, home right now fishing. Yeah. Mm. It has, it has it really changed this life of these people completely. You know, most of the young boys they are fishing here. This lake contains a lot of iron. Yeah? A lot of what? A lot of iron, a lot of metal, metal mineral. So wh why do you eat the fish then? Because we have no like, like any other fish. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to swim? <laughs> do you want to swim? This is clean water. <laughs> I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, my name is James Wakibia and I'm a plastic waste activist based in Kenya. And um, what's going on with the lake, Nakuru? What are the, what are the main threats to the lake? The increased flooding has uh, led to many issues around the lake uh, because it has uh, flooded into people's homes and uh, oh, hundreds of people have been displaced. Uh, agricultural runs have, have now become fishing grounds. The lake has moved for, for about one, one kilometer from its main shore. So lake Nakuru is a protected area. It's a recognized uh, UNESCO World Heritage Site and it is suffering from many things. From around 20 15th year, that's when flooding has been increasing and every time there is a lot of flooding, there is a lot of uh, runoff. I think the biggest uh, problem with Lake Nakuru is contamination of the waters from uh, industrial waste. There is a lot of farming in the upstream and when there is that kind of farming, uh, there is of course a lot of siltation and soil erosion and all that is coming down to to the lake. Also residents who live around uh, the river, River Njoro, which is the main contributor or the river that brings most of this water to the lake, carries a lot of plastics. Birds and mostly flamingos have shifted this, but initially there were millions. And in fact, uh, Nakuru was it used to be called the pink town. But nowadays you can't see many flamingos in the lake. That is a very nice thing with the dogs. The enemy of Saika. They are really flamingo. bad. The enemy. And Bayan, Bayan. They are... Oh, that's my Rudy. I'm going to pick up a Rudy. You know, initially it was alkaline. And uh, then there used to be a lot of food for, for flamingo, which is algae. But today there is no algae because I think the lake is becoming more fresh by the day. But with the more flooding, uh, the fish are thriving, you know. There are so many fish and the community saw this as a blessing in disguise. We do not know how safe the fish is. The government says the fish is contaminated. The community says the fish is good, we have been eating it. So the government banned fishing in Lake Nakuru. But people uh, still continue to fish because I don't think uh, they have another option. They are people from low-income areas. Their main, ag main economic activity was agriculture. Now they can do farming. Even the study itself is not so clear and it's not so open to the public. Most people are not getting the information they need. Solutions will come from studies first to understand that we have this problem. You know, the community all, all also needs to be kept aware. Not always policing them and telling them what to do, but I think the best way is to sit them down, make them understand that when we conserve the environment, it is us who, who will benefit. With, uh, with climate change, you cannot plan for the next five years because the weather is erratic, things have really changed, Months that were dry are very wet, you know, months that were very cold are warm, so we do not even understand what is really happening. I'm still optimistic. We might still work with how things are. You know, we understand, fine, the lake is flooding. We embrace that flooding, 
the flooded area become part of the lake and uh, we introduce other things like um, the community has introduced boat riding so it's just a matter of embracing climate change and seeing how the benefits that can it can bring <laughs> Yeah, it's, 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 it's